Hello everyone, this is White Mage Serenia, welcoming you back to Let's Play Legends of Ligaya. In the last episode, we figured out that Sangi had attacked the Byron Ministry, Monastery, and uh, the Elder had asked us to go revive the Genesis Tree into the East, so let's go. Uh, yeah, we just gotta head up to the East here. Now, it's hard for me to find things to say about Legends of Ligaya sometimes, especially on the world map. But, we'll try. Here we have a couple of new enemies. The Gombu and the Hornet. Uh, the Hornet we've not seen before. It's just a B-type enemy. It does have a, a move called Venom Sting, I believe it is, which can cause the Venom status. And the, the Gombu there is just a higher level version of the Gobu Gobus. You can, it has the same attacks and whatnot. Just more HP, more attacks per turn. Things like that. Nothing too threatening, though. A little concerned about that Hornet, however. Pyro Pummel! No, no. Ah, he blocked almost all of Gala's hits there. Ah, uh, no worries. Everyone team up on the Gomp, or the, the, yeah, the B, because I'm not sure what it can do. Sonic Javelin! There we go, there goes uh, the Gombu down. Yeah, Poisonous Sting, there it is. Pyro Pummel, there we go, we got him, no big deal, no big threat. We got 130 EXP and 77 gold. Yamudu, baby. I got the other trust. Alright, here we go on M to the forest. Alright, oh, then. East Vaz Forest. Wait a moment, everyone. I feel something. I feel Songi's presence. Songi's here. Von, Noah, I need you two to promise me something. Even if Songi appears before you, don't fight him. I know this is asking a lot, but... If a Suryu possessed his soul as you say, then I won't be the one to take care of him. I will detain you no longer. Come, let's hurry. Now, this forest is going to be a little bit different than the uh, West Vaz. As you can see, there are, like, crystalline weeds in our way. Is the goal. Yep, here we have two new enemies, the Mushroom and the Twin Tom. The Twin Tom over there has a really nasty combo attack, and they're just really, really fast. And that mu those Mushroom have the Venom attack, or the the, the, the uh, Spore attack that I mentioned back in the first episode that introduced Noah, which adds the Rot status. So that's just something you want to keep in mind. Go after the Twin Toms first, because they are fast and they are deadly. Okay, they have the Poisonous Spore. Okay, that just adds Poison, I believe. Okay, Twin Tom's gone. Running Kick. Bum, 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 bum. Battering Ram. Alright. She should be able to do that with only 26 AP. Nope. Oh well. No worries, we get an item later on that makes it so that we basically have infinite AP, so... Hyper Elbow! 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 Battering Ram! Oh, we're just about at the five minute mark. This ain't good. Just do whatever, Noah. I'm gonna have Gala use the auto command. You'll find yourself you'll find yourself uh, doing just any move like that once you have all the arts, because those arts use AP, and you have only one, a limit of 100 AP. So sometimes it's you just find yourself doing random attack to try to conserve that. Well, it depends, really. If you're on a boss fight, you might uh, use spirit and use your most powerful arts, whatnot. I did a little bit of healing there, no problem. So head on up this way and take the right here because we're going to get something called a weed hammer. All right, and we're back. That was just another couple of twin tombs and mushrooms there. So come on down here, grab the weed hammer. 
This is the item we needed, because now we can break those crystal weeds. Oh, a weed hammer. Gala, what's a weed hammer? It's something used to break crystal grass and other types of hard grass. Oh. And just like the name implies, hit the crystal grass with X, and there you go. Bam! We broke through, baby! Woot! Magic Leaf is an item that restores... Here we have a new Suru, Gazam. He's a uh, water-slash-ice type Suru, so you want to try to absorb him not with... Uh, actually, um, Vaughn, I want you to spirit. I mean, uh, Noah... Down, up, down, left, right. Thank you. We want to charm him and then kill N uh, Naito as soon as we can. There we go. Toes. All right. Now. We do not want Vaughn to absorb uh, Gazam, and we don't want to kill it. So we're going to have Noah try to absorb it. So yay. Yeah, he's charmed, so he can't use his big move that hurts a lot. So have Vaughn use Spirit again. Noah, I want you to do three Rosaru attacks on Gizm. No, or, uh, Gala, you go after Naito again. Nope, still didn't absorb it. Uh-oh. He's almost gone, though. All right. Vaughn's getting AP back, too. Water column. Not good, not good. This move hurts. It hurts bad. There you go. If that would have been on Vaughn, yeah. That would have hurt even more. Because if I recall correctly, it does about 300 and something to Vaughn. Well, it might not have where he's in uh, spirit mode, but hey. It's still something to keep in mind. Uh, Yeah, let's use a healing bloom. Aw, oh, man. Oh, well. There's always later. Thank you, Gala. Alright, now... Vaughn, since you have so much TP now, and a lot of art blocks, let's do down, down, down. No, 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 I want to do down, up, up, up. Down, right, oh, okay. Down, 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 up, up, up it is. Okay, there we go. Terra, you just do whatever. Gala, you do whatever. You're gone. Woo, Vaughn's level increased. Lovely. It means he gets more strength and HP and whatnot. Yay for Vaughn. Woo. So, okay. Now that we have the weed hammer, we can get some treasures throughout in the throughout the area here. Especially the one back at the entrance here. So head back this way and then over here. Alright, we're back. And there is one major flaw with Legends of Lagaya. It's slow. <laughs> the random battles can take a while if you're uh, not knowing what you're doing. Alright, we're back. As I was saying, if you don't know where to go and where you're fighting, it can take it a while. So just come over here get the Guardian Water. Guardian Water does, it increases their defense. It's simple as that. It's plus four, so we're going to give that to Noah again. That way, she's not very weak. <sighs> okay, now, let's head on up here and see what we can find. Let's head north now. Alright, and we're back again. That was just uh, another Gizom and uh, Naito. So keep on heading up this way. More weeds to break. Bang, bang, bang. All right. Head to the east or the west here, and we get a cure amulet. That I think blocks with the rot status. So let's see. Yeah, nullify all venom attacks. So since we ain't got nothing better, we're gonna go ahead and uh, equip him with that. All right, we're back. Um, okay, so now that we have that, just keep on heading back to the north here. Okay, head over here. There's more weeds to break and more trip. Sure. Alright, more... Oops. 
All right, and we're back. Uh, I'm gonna have to sign off after I get these treasure chests. I'm completely out of time. Survival Club, that is for Gala. And we get an antidote. All right, go equip the Survival Club to Gala. That's gonna give him a lot, whoa, a lot more attack power. That's gonna make him a lot more useful. All right, guys, uh, this has been White Mage Serenia with Let's Play Legends of Ligaya. Hope you've been enjoying these, and, uh, be, check, be on the lookout for Let's Play Final Fantasy VI Episode 40, I believe it is, coming soon. Have a nice day, everyone.